All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Mashoka Sensei Season 2, Episode 3. Uh, last episode was very good. Uh, we finally kind of got Sarah over to... Well, I say we. Rudius has finally got uh, Sarah over to his side because he saved her life. Definitely seems like she's, fall she's fallen for him now. Like, it was already on the way there when he, like, kind of helped out Counter Arrow. And, you know, they were coming... Becoming kind of close, but she was still kind of had, like, that prickly kind of feeling towards him but now it's it definitely seems like she isn't she's a completely different person uh it's kind of the same thing that happened with eddie's i suppose like how prickly she was at the start and then she kind of fell for him um yeah uh, i like it uh, we lost what was his name mimir one of the members of counter arrow i understand that they were like it's part of the job it can happen any day any time they were sad it just seems like I don't know, to me it kind of felt like they weren't distraught enough and it, it kind of moved on fairly quickly. Um, but yeah, overall I'm very excited for this. I'm looking forward to seeing how the, this now progresses with the group. Hopefully no more of them die or nothing bad happens to them. But you know, Mishoka Zensai. But yeah, anyway guys, uh, if you liked the video, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh yeah, and I was confused about his nickname, but you guys explained that to me. Appreciate it. Yeah? She's so friendly with him now. <laughs> yes. She's going to be jealous. Oh, so... Trust me, Rudius knows some girls. I was going to say, well, is that a design feature or is that just chipped? As in, do you want to go on a date? Is that you're aware this is a date? Yeah, okay. Damn, those peaches look peachy. If, if they're peaches, they look like peaches. Ooh, lots of cool daggers. Did they both get one, or did she get just two? Uh, I suppose it could be helpful for Rudy to have one as well. Does he not already have a close-range weapon? I never thought about that. <laughs> oh, of course. Don't give Rudius these thoughts. Yeah. Oh, wait, they're drinking alcohol? So what, kids can just buy daggers and drink alcohol in this world? Okay. Oh god, something's gonna happen between these two. I mean, yeah. Oh boy. <laughs> this fucking guy. Oh. What does that look for? Oh, she's, she's definitely getting drunk here. <laughs> oh, God. He's not ready for this. You've done it already. With a different girl. Well, there's no... There's no like, door? Probably going to need a door. Doesn't bed look... Doesn't, doesn't look very comfy either. <laughs> Go ahead, yeah. Is this actually going to happen? Wait, what's wrong with Rudius? Why do you say huh? Is he? Oh my god. He's not feeling it? Damn. He just ain't got the feeling. The same feeling for her. Why does he look less muscly here? He was jacked last episode. Damn. Well, that's awkward. <laughs> the censoring just covering half of the screen right now. Aww. That sucks. Damn, she doesn't mean that. Oh, 
Well, that's just ruined everything, hasn't it? Get your cheeks away, bro. Oh, now he's going into an alcoholic face. Oh my god! I was like, is this dude gonna fucking fight or something? Yeah, you just let him punch you. I'm honestly so surprised in, with that situation with Sarah. In, like, is it because of Edis? Like, he, he just has feelings for one person? Shout out this dude just letting himself get slugged. Like, even if it is by like a, what, a 13, 14 year old, it's still, still got to hurt in some way. Dude is venting or letting out his frustrations hard right now in this bar. This dude's a good guy. He came off as egotistical at first, but he is a good guy. <laughs> okay, straight into it. It's like deeper though, like why he can't do it. He obviously wanted to. So it's more like trust issues, I guess. Maybe that's why. <laughs> it was your first time. Relax, bro. Oh god, where we go? Oh, okay. We're going to like a red light district. Interesting. Yeah, I'm now we're taking a kid to a brothel. Nice. <laughs> and these 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 women are all older. Okay. Do you give your full name in places like this? Oh, that's nice. Oh, younger sister, like actual sister. I thought you meant like someone that worked with her. Ah, so karma's coming back to you here. Good karma. Is this really the way to go about kind of resolving this kind of inner conflict with himself? So it's supposed to have someone take charge will help, but I don't know, we'll see. Can't tell how old this girl is, like they're the same height. Damn. Didn't work with her either. Frightened of women. Aw. I mean... Roxy? Yeah. Yeah, there's not many other women left in the world. Uh, that, with that kind of set of skills for him. I don't, I don't think all this drinking is going to help. <laughs> these two these two are going to have awful hangovers. Well, at least Rudy is. Make me laugh how this entire episode is about sex. <laughs> oh no, he's still very drunk. Okay. That's true. Mm. Learn to know her more and trust her more and know that she's not going to fuck you over. Yeah, exactly. That's good advice. She didn't mean that. How Rudius doesn't recognize that. He's, he's not very... He's not overly good at picking up signals. I think he's better than other anime protagonists. He's so drunk. I like how this guy is like a, being like a big brother to him right now. Oh, fucking hell. Really? Why she has to be here? Oh. Oh, no. Oh, okay. This is what I was expecting her to be angry, but she looks so upset. Oh shit, Rudius, you fucking idiot. 
Oh, she even threw away a dagger. God damn it, man. Yes, it was. You damn fool. Stop drinking. <laughs> what are you doing with the blade? Oh my god! Jesus Christ, that was close. That was so quick, he was literally going to. Are we changing groups? What? Or is it just temporary? Bro, he just took you out for, for a night out on the town. Of course he doesn't hate you. I like this guy. Yeah, for sure. The amazing mage. Oh wait, is this um... Oh! Isn't this Roxy's friend? Is this uh, this is the horny woman, isn't it? If I remember remember correctly. Yeah, it is. <laughs> why are you why are you so easy? Come on. Yeah. Both of them. That was too easy. Right. So that was Mishoku Tensai season two, episode three. That really was just an entire episode based around sex. That's crazy. <laughs> um. Ah, that really sucked. It Sarah just looked destroyed there. I'm so sad. I feel so bad for her. Really, is she? Goddamn idiot! Never drink again. Um, I really hope there's some there's some way he'd be able to kind of repair that bond between them. It's gonna take a lot after what he said. It was really brutal, really dumb. Um, he really needs to just quit drinking. Uh, but yeah, I like that Soldat was really kind of, a, he's a good character. I'm glad what he what he did and what he was here for Rudius, just like a big brother, trying to help him with his problems. Um, it's going to be interesting now as well, then Rudius is going to go out on like a, an expedition with them. And uh, we'll see how they fight and, you know, how Rudius fights with them, I guess. But yeah, uh, apparently Roxy's coming to town, supposedly. I mean, that was her friend, so... Yeah, that'll be interesting considering he's probably she's probably the only girl in the world that he actually trusts in that way. So we'll, we'll see what's going to happen with that. But uh, yeah, anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. Uh, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.